Uh, this video tutorial is to demonstrate how to take care of a stoma, cleaning it and changing the patient system. And now for every procedure, we should greet the patient, introduce ourselves, explain the procedure and gain consent from the patient, ensure privacy, ensure there's no pain, and wash your hands before and after the uh, procedure. Uh, now, uh, let's introduce the equipment we need for this procedure. Now, this is the equipment we need for the stoma care procedure. Uh, we have the gloves. Uh, we have the uh, parching systems. We have two types. We have the one-piece parching system in which the wafer is attached to the pouch. We have the uh, two-piece parching system in which the wafer is not attached to the bag. And we have the clip to fasten uh, the end of the pouch. We have the scissors, the adhesive remover. We have the uh, measuring card and a pen. We have the drapes. We have uh, paper towels. Uh, we have the basin with uh, warm water. So uh, after we've worn the gloves, uh, we need to inspect the stoma uh, for color, swelling, trauma, healing, bleeding, and leakage if there was a previous uh, parching system. Uh, healthy stoma should be uh, raised above the skin but not detached from it, uh, red and moist, not erythematous, ulcerated, or inflamed. So uh, that's it for the inspection. Uh, so uh, now we need to uh, take the paper towel uh, rinse it in the uh, warm water, wash around the uh, stoma without scrubbing, going from inside out. And then uh, let, we let the uh, skin dry. Uh, we use the adhesive remover if uh, there was a sticky residue uh, around the skin. And then we use the uh, measuring card with uh, the pen to see what uh, to see exactly what the size of the stoma. So this is 50 uh, millimeters. And then uh, we take the uh, parching system and we cut uh, exactly the same size of uh, the measuring card we took. So uh, it should be uh, 55 millimeters so uh, this should do it uh, for the 50 uh, uh, millimeters now we remove the uh, adhesive packing then we uh, take the parching system to put it around uh, the stoma after we apply pressure around the uh, stoma so that uh, it is attached, uh, we need to uh, fasten uh, the end of uh, the parching system so that it doesn't leak. And this is it for the attaching uh, the parching system. Now, if a previous parching system was present, we need to observe any sign of leakage from the parching system. And then we put the drape under the parching system. Then we gently apply pressure on the skin and remove the parching system. We discard it. And then if we need to attach a new parching system, we, ro we wash around the stoma and repeat the previous steps. Uh, after we finish the procedure, we uh, thank the patient and help him get dressed. Uh, we take off the gloves and uh, wash our hands, and we need also to document the procedure.